is the Hydroshock by Ramcat Broadheads, and this is why you need this head. This broadhead is designed to fly exactly like a field point, so that means less time tuning and more time in the woods. The concave scoop allows body mass to be displaced over and around the broadhead, so you have increased entrance and exit wounds. We actually have back cut technology, so what this will allow the blades to do is pivot forward upon impact, and it'll actually cut on its way back out as the deer is moving. And you'll spend less time trying to track that animal. The Hydroshock by Ramcat Broadheads. Hey folks, Chris James here at Muzzy Broadheads. I wanted to talk to you a little bit today about the Muzzy HB-X, which is the uh, crossbow version of our HB Broadhead. Um, this is an awesome little head. It gives you the best of both worlds. The HB is basically stands for hybrid, and it gives you the confidence of shooting a fixed blade head because it has a one inch fixed cut here, as well as the uh, bigger cutting diameter and the entry wounds of an expandable broadhead. This would be a one and five eighths, so a total of two and five eighths cutting surface. Going through the animal, it's going to leave a nice big hole. It's got the, the muzzy um, chisel tip on the front of it, designed to bust bone. That's a hardened steel ferrule. And then we've got uh, 35 thousandths uh, expandable blades and 35 thousandths uh, fixed blades here. So you're going to get a really nice solid head, super dependable. The retention system is a friction collar, so no matter what, this cannot pre-deploy, the, just the inertia of taking off from a bow or a crossbow is going to lay this back. Even if you shoot one out, it'll always lay that one back and it can never put more pressure on these little shoulders than it's putting on the larger surface area here because of weight. So there's no way that this can pre-deploy. Uh, there's no O-rings or anything else to worry about. So it, it's a very simple design, very dependable, uh, and it just flies very, very well, especially out of a crossbow. Um, you know, I encourage you to check these out. If you want to try them, you know, I would, I would definitely recommend this if you're looking for a dependable broadhead that you can shoot on a crossbow or a vertical bow. Uh, it's available in 100 and a 125, and it does have our ferrule alignment technology on it as well. Hey, I'm John Severson with the Rage Broadheads, and I'm here to talk to you today about a, a new broadhead that we have for 2017. It's uh, the Rage 3 Blade. It's a, a redesigned version of our 3 Blade. You know, when we started Rage Broadheads, it was two skews it was a two blade and a three blade and and uh since then in 2006 we've we've built several um different broadheads that have come along and and uh the three blade was one that we needed to improve um first thing that you're going to notice about it um we're, we're only offering in the chisel tip um in our three blade the chisel tip um has been a really popular version so we beefed up the chisel tip on this three blade um, the other thing that we did was we we made the blades thicker so they're 35 thousandths the original one was um 30 thousandths thick blades so we did that we strengthened the side panels we did a bunch of different things um to make this this broadhead stronger the other thing one of the main things that we did to it is we we use a shock collar now for blade retention so instead of the the o-ring that the three blade has always had you've got a shock collar that goes on and and uh, that's what's going to hold your blades in place so it's basically designed the same as our other um shot collars where they're designed to break away so you want to make sure that the your blades themselves sit on pedals so you don't want them sitting in the slits but they're designed to break away as these blades deploy the other thing with this broadhead is we opened it up to a, it's a 1.6 inch cut where it used to be 1.5 so it's just a really improved version of our of our three blade broadhead you know there's there's a lot of schools of thought, different things when it comes to personal preference as to why would I shoot a two blade over a three blade or why would I shoot a three blade over a two blade and it really does come down to personal preference and what you you feel comfortable shooting and, and uh, you know there's a lot of people out there that, that prefer a three blade broadhead. Um, you know one of the biggest um, misconceptions I guess with a two blade broadhead is is that they're going to cut a slit as it goes through the animal and, and uh, with the Rage, the way the Rage designed, it, it definitely does not cut a slit in a two blade. Um, but some people just prefer to have that that uh, that third blade. And uh, this is really a wicked broadhead. Check it out at RageBroadheads.com. There's some cool footage, some cool things you can see how this broadhead works, performs, how it deploys. It's really, really a good broadhead. So check it out.